What's going on Rocket Vegan crew? Welcome back to another video. My name is Liz if you're new here and we're going to be taste testing two things that I found at Walmart from the Coconut Collaborative. So let's see how they taste. So I was wandering around Walmart and I found these two products I've never seen before or tried before so we're going to try them here today so it should be a pretty quick taste test for us. Um, we have the chocolate lava cakes and the chocolate ganache desserts. Um, so let's talk about them real quick. So the first one I have here is the Coconut Collaborative Dark Chocolate Lava Cake. There's two cakes in here. It only takes 30 seconds to get them heated, heated up. Uh, this was $4.47 for two of them. You can take a look at the ingredients and all that here on the back. 350 calories for one serving, so one cake. And then we have the Chocolate Ganache Plant-Based Desserts, 100 calories per cup. These look like little pudding cups or something and you can see all the ingredients and everything on the back as well. We're gonna try the ganache first and then we're gonna heat up the lava cake and save that one for last and see how they taste. So these are also gluten-free, ethically sourced. So this is made with coconut, hence the name. So, so we got this little tiny cup. It's like literally less than the size of my hand. So 100 calories for this. I'd probably eat like all four of them. But I'll, I'll contain myself. I know ganache is supposed to be a little bit more like like thick and whatever. Oh yeah, super thick, super thick. Not just pudding consistency. It's okay. Just like a, a pudding cup, like a thicker, just a thicker kind of pudding cup. Stays on spoon, like frosting, it's like a mix between frosting and pudding. It's fine. It's chocolate. Tastes delicious. I don't think I have a. Oh snap! Hello. I don't think it has like a super strong coconut flavor, but I love coconut, so maybe I just don't taste it. Um, this is okay. For 100 calories, I feel like I should be eating a lot more, but that's just me. But I also don't, you know, portion control and portion size and whatever, so. Let's definitely finish the rest of it. It is really good. I just don't know if I would go out of my way to get it again. But it's available at Walmart, so you can't beat that. You don't have to go to any fancy Whole Foods or anything, so. This is good. I guess it's, it, it was less than $3, so it's like less than a dollar for each. That's not that bad either, so. Anywho, let's try the one that I really am excited about. The dark chocolate lava cake. Let's try this next. 350 calories from one of these cups. And it comes into like, comes in a little, almost like a cupcake type of cup. And it already had collapsed completely. I don't know if it's supposed to do that. I don't really care. It's cake and it's chocolate and it looks delicious. Um, but I don't know if it was in, supposed to stay completely upright before I like cut into it like a normal lava cake. But let's try it. Definitely, I guess, ruins the experience, huh? If it's already, like, oozing out. Oh. Okay. Okay, then. Yep. I probably have chocolate all in my teeth, but holy smokes, that's freaking good. 100% would get that again. That one's even more expensive one, so me telling you that is weird. Uh, 4.47 for two of these, but like one, it's so decadent, and the cake is so good and fluffy. I don't think this is uh, gluten free. Oh, it is. The ingredients look gluten free to me. Yeah, that seems gluten free to me, but you guys can double check the ingredients and see what you think. That is super good. So I would definitely get this one 100% again. The other one was not bad at all. The ganache was still delicious. It just wasn't for me. I would probably, I would rather just have this instead. Spend a little bit extra to get something more decadent that would like actually savor my chocolate craving for longer, you know? So I'm gonna enjoy the rest of this. I hope you enjoyed the super quick taste test. And if you find these in a Walmart near you, let me know what you thought of them. Or if you tried them before, let me know what you thought. And 
that is it. We're gonna go ahead and head out of here. If you didn't see the community post, I will be posting every Sunday instead of Saturday. That is the new plan, is doing it on Sundays. Uh, and again, if you are interested in video gaming or anything, I have my link down below to my Twitch channel that I stream pretty much every day except Saturdays, hence why I have a little bit more free time now. Um, so feel free to check that out if you're interested. And that is it. Make sure to subscribe and join the Rockin' Bean crew, like this video, and have a rockin' night. Thank you.